WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finished down 287, NASDAQ off 202, S&P's down 57. Gold, gold contract up $11.20, trading at 1991 an ounce. We have silver up 49 cents, $23.53 an ounce. Light sweet crude down 62 cents, $88.75 a barrel, notes and bonds. A 10 year note up 19 ticks, trading 106.01, 30 year up 20 ticks at 108.16, and King Dollar. King dollar traded down 87 ticks at 106.166, euro 105, yen 149, British pound 120, well, 121 to 1 US dollar. Now, let's go over and look at the gold contract because this is going to get intriguing. And this is what I mean by this. So you've already always heard the mantra, you know, if interest rates are high, you're not going to buy gold, right? Well, interest rates have never been higher and people are buying gold hand over fist from this bottom. You know, we just went from a price point now of the 1821 area to 1992. And if we switch to the bond market, this is where this is going to get really intriguing for the metal bulls, is that if, in fact, you know, what happened out here today is that the 10-year rejected lower price. Now, it's, it's done it a couple times. It's done it one, two. It's done it twice prior to this meaning in the last three weeks. And, you know, the last time it did it, we did get some falls through for four days, then it gave it up in spades, broke out the bottom, had volume on the breakout. Now it's crawling back inside, because at 1.7 million, you know, you can say that, okay, you're testing the lows, uh, you know, you don't have a sign of strength yet, that's the bottom line, which you're gonna need. That being said, what is so intriguing about the note market and the bond market and gold is that when you actually look at it, it's like, okay, if in fact this bond market pulls back at all, the gold market's gonna get another acceleration. And then we go into the dollar, we take a look at the dollar, you can see the dollar hasn't had much movement since it basically broke, there we go, it broke its channel, and you know, it's been messing around up here. So, I suspect the doll is done, though. Have a great weekend, folks. Have a safe weekend. Come back and visit Tommy Monday morning. Kicks us off 9 a.m. Great show, folks.